Hello Team Capricorn, it's Empire333 here. Welcome back to my channel. This is your love tarot reading Capricorn and we will be getting into each person's energy and we'll also um, pick up some advice and anything intuitively coming through. So this is, did I say that Capricorn? This is your love tarot card reading. Okay, I hope I said that. This will not have an extended if you're interested in a personal reading with me guided reading it is down below the information in the description box spirit what energies is capricorn in okay Ooh. yeah all right <laughs> i don't know what's going on today okay guys some energy is really like coming through me cards are flying all the stuff Okay. I just heard a willing participant. So I feel like someone's not being a willing participant. Okay, Capricorn. Like somebody's not wor working with you. I don't know why. It's like you've even asked this person to meet you halfway, not even like ex overly extend themselves. And they have not. Not cool. Okay, and just to let you know, I do give my advice sometimes, okay? That's my advice. I'm entitled to it. If you don't like that, um, maybe I'm not the psychic for you, okay? Uh, and keep in mind, for those of you who are new, I am an intuitive channel, okay? So um, I pick up on different things than what the cards say, okay? So... Yes. So you and your lover are on some type of break right now. Okay. You feel so connected to this person, Capricorn. But what I'm hearing here is that you're tired of their, their lack of energy. Okay. The lack. So I feel like you do feel lack with this person. Um, or you've already walked away from them. This person would not meet you in the middle. I don't know why. You've tried, um, you keep getting rejected by them, like they reject you somehow. You're focusing on work, which is a good thing, okay? You're focusing on your pentacles, you're focusing on work. Let's get into this person's energy because this is not cool. All right, so let's see. Spirit, what can you tell us about Capricorn's person? Moon? What does that mean? Is somebody's name Moon here? Or does somebody have a moon tattoo? Very interesting. Okay. Ooh, Capricorn. You know what I saw? This is fun stuff. Somebody's doing some magic. So I don't know if it's you or your person. I see a mortar, mortal. What is it? Mortar and pestle? What, martyr? I don't know, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Somebody's in the kitchen doing some herby stuff. All right, working with some herbs. I just heard manifesto, so I don't know if somebody speaks Spanish here, but it's like doing some type of manifestation spells. Interesting. <sighs> That's always fun. I mean, for me. Okay. So, all right. Capricorn's person, spirit. This is so interesting. So, Capricorn, a lot of you walked away from someone. Okay. You walked away from someone. It was not easy. But... You did it slowly. And like, you didn't do it all at once. You did it slowly, okay? You feel betrayed by this person. It's like you're dealing with a, you know this person is a king of wands energy, but they don't act like the king of wands, okay? You know the energy of king of wands, right? This person doesn't act like it with you. Like, they don't behave um, like this, okay? And... That's why you also feel betrayed by this person. 
like, wait, wait a minute. You can give that energy to other people, but you can't give it to me. And what I'm seeing here is that because of this, they think, okay, they, they don't know what to think about you now, okay? Because they didn't think you would walk away from them, Capricorn, like, or give up, I should say. You gave up. And it's like they want to clarify things with you, but they don't want to fight with you, okay? They think you have other people now. Let them think that, you know. Maybe that'll actually put that that uh, pedal for, forward, right? But this person is heartbroken. I'm letting you know. This person does not show affection. Um, they don't show how they feel. They're not that person. They care for people at a distance. It's kind of like, oh, you're in my heart, you know? You're in my heart, babe, but, you know, boo, you're in my heart. I care about you. But it's like when it comes to action, they don't. Unless, unless they want, you know, a hot and steamy bedroom time. That's when they give you attention, okay? This is interesting. Anything else, Spirit, you want to tell us about this person? What's the bottom? Three of Pentacles. So this is what I'm talking about. I don't know why you and this person, you go around in circles meeting halfway. Why is that? Why aren't they, you know, this person, Capricorn, they've learned so much from you. You know that? You are like a teacher to them. They should at least have some, you know, give some love because of that, okay? Even if they're not acknowledging all the other stuff that you put into this connection. Uh, yeah, they, see, this is a person that works really slow when it comes to you. And what I'm hearing here is like, um, my patience went out the window. Like you're... Just like I tried, I gave it all, all my, whatever, you know, wow, yes, yeah, this person goes around in cycles, okay, um, I feel like they go in cycles of pulling back their energy, you pull back their energy, then they come in, they say something, then they go back, blah, 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 it's like this repetitive cycle, um, circles, okay, you know that Post Malone song, I don't know if it's called circles, but it's like the... Um, it's like the slow song. Oh my God, I have it in my head. I can't get the words out. Okay, I can't get the words. But you know what I'm talking about, like going in circles, okay? So this is a cycle that keeps repeating between you both. That like this person might, you know how they are? They might make up excuses why to talk to you. So they come through like that. They never like come back and be like, you know what? Um... Like, even if they want to know what you're doing or what's what's up, how you feel about them, they'll be like, oh, remember that, you know, that um, um, the name of that, I don't know. Um, remember that, that supplement you had, that vitamin, uh, what was it called again? What was that vitamin called? Like, they'll make up reasons to reach out to you. And I feel like they're going to do it again. So, Capricorn, if you have not heard from this person, you will hear from this person. Let's see what they're going to say. Okay. Yep. So, Capricorn, this person is still going to keep their feelings at bay. Um, they don't know. They have no clarity about what is going to happen between you two. I feel like they're going to say something and then just observe whatever behavior you have. Okay. But they do want to heal this. They feel very attached to you. Okay. So let's see. Anything else, Spirit? Yeah, they might apologize to you about not being clear themselves, they're going to blame something else like, oh, I've been going through this. Oh, I've been going through that. It's that type of energy. Okay. So let's pull some spiritual advice for you. Oh, 
Hold on. Okay, Capricorn. So let's see. Okay. What spiritual advice Spirit wants to say to you about this situation? Balancing masculine and feminine energies. Okay, so you could have been a feminine in your masculine energy. And that made this person feel so comfortable. So um, they got used to that. They got in their comfort zone. And now since you don't do that, it's just weird. Okay. Let's see. New or renewed romantic love is here for you. So Rose Quartz is more heart healing. You know, um, Virgo, I think it was a Virgo or Taurus also got this life lessons. So you're definitely learning a life lesson in this connection. Ask for the negative patterns you keep repeating. So really um, think about that. And this is somebody who is pushing you more towards your spiritual path. Okay, so this could be a soulmate that is like really helping you... Um, love yourself more so that you can be pushed to your spiritual path okay so there's a lot of um lessons here this is a soulmate that you are dealing with your true beliefs are becoming clearer to you which prompts you to make nice necessary life changes so definitely i feel like you both are each other's teacher okay you both help each other more okay like you help each other um your soul you evolve through one another, but some of you, it's like you're ahead of this person, but you're really changing how you feel about the whole soulmate thing. Like you're having second doubts at this time because you're realizing that it's caused you a lot of pain and suffering and you can't do it with this person because they can't even meet you halfway. So this person is not budging. Okay. So, but you are learning lessons. So make sure to focus on the lessons, what you learned so you can heal your heart and um, new love is coming in for you, Capricorn, as you do that, okay? And make sure that you're balanced in your energies with the next person that comes in. I don't see this person. I just see communication. I don't see anywhere going for now. But like I said, if you want a personal, you can. that information is down below. I hope this has helped you. If it has, don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you have not and you like my vibe and my style of reading. I wish you all the best. Peace out.